am so excited to be here with our MVP of Summer 2023, E.G. Jojo Pion. I appreciate Welcome. it. Thank you. I mean, I mean, I don't know. I won MVP, but like, it feels weird because I'm not here. You know, I'm not here playing, so it feels like ass, but you know, it happens. Like, it. Does it also feel a little weird because everyone kind of started talking to you about MVP at the start of the split, it feels like? You've been kind of approached about this for quite some time, but now it is official. It is still an accolade to be proud of, regardless of the other circumstances of being here. I mean, I'm definitely proud of winning MVP, but at the same time, I feel like, you know, if I win MVP in the regular season and I'm not here in the finals, it doesn't really matter to me. So this is like kind of a wake-up call for me next play to really win, you know? a wake-up call obviously there's the things you're looking on and kind of wanting to get right back to the stage but there's a lot of positives to take away from what allowed you to play consistently and hopefully come to the stage again what do you think it is about the off-season Korean boot camp and your application that did earn you this consistent award something that shows what you were able to do in the regular season and future stages to come I mean, I think the boot camp really helped me, but also I think playing with my new teammates really helped me because I had to like become a leader kind of and kind of lead the team. So I feel like I really evolved in that sense. So I really think I learned a lot this split. Yeah, you were put into a leadership position really early in your career. I think sometimes it's easy to forget how quickly it has happened because you've already gotten so many accolades. Is there something in particular when playing around those teammates, when working into being a leader that sticks with you as kind of that off the roof skill that's really developed? I mean, it really, you really have to be like calm and stable off the game and you really have to be emo like not emotional at all. So it's pretty hard, but you know, it's something that I got a lot better at and yeah. And I'm sure that's something that you'll be leaning into in future performances. There's just so much discussion around it, your performance specifically. I know North American mids, for instance, that's been rising a lot. We've got a couple of them taken to the stage today, but it feels like it was ignited by you as this protege coming in. Do you have any thoughts on that discussion and kind of what you ignited in it specifically? I mean, it's pretty crazy because it could have been three NA mids playing at this arena, but you know, I messed up, so it's my fault, but um, people that say like NA mids are not good or whatever, I mean, if you look at it today, there's two NA mids playing right now and they have a lot of potential, so you guys have to cheer for them. And I'm sure a lot of fans have confidence that you will be joining as well at some point in the state in the future. You've done so in the past. Do you want to give a little prediction on today or are you kind of just chilling, sitting back? I don't even know, like, honestly, I feel like both teams can win it. I think whoever just plays better on the day, I think they're pretty even in skill. But if I had to cheer for someone, it'd probably be NRG. Seems there are others on that side. I can see in your eyes, I feel like you're already focused on the competition to come, readying yourself up for the future. But what do you have in this moment reflecting for all the fans that have supported you, for those of you that have gotten to this point, what do you want to say to them about this moment and what is to come? I mean, to all the fans that's been supporting me, like I truly appreciate you guys. I mean, I wish I could be playing here today and winning for my fans, but I mean, next time I'll be here for sure. I'm so glad that you're able to come and join us on the stage here today in this capacity, Jojo. Congratulations again on your MVP. Thank you. Thank you. Let that sink in and bring that away with you after this weekend as well. The chance from the audience. This feels great. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Good feelings here on the stage. Thank you, fans. Let's go back to our analysts and get on with the show.